So we are back from our break. In case you missed it, in our last video, we announced that we are gonna be having another baby. That's right, we are so excited to be a family of seven in just a few months. So we left you all with the big question of what is coming next? If you haven't been following our channel for that long, you may not know, but we were planning on renovating this Airstream that I'm currently sitting in and actually living in it. What our vision was is we wanted to minimize uh, everything in our life and really just kind of focus on what it is that we wanted to accomplish in life. Uh, we wanted to downsize, we wanted to um, just get rid of a lot of the junk and not have a lot of those kind of distractions of life and live in a tiny space for a while. Uh, we were going to be staying uh, here in Texas and actually living in, in a campground. Um, I was still going to be working at the Ford dealership that I work at as well as doing, um, you know, like this, this side project, this YouTube channel as well as some other things that I've been working on. Um, and then, you know, potentially we travel, we weren't 100% sure exactly the direction that things were going, uh, going to go in, but uh, we knew that we wanted um, really to just prioritize family and, and really just the things that we wanted in life. Uh, we wanted to be, you know, debt free and, um, you know, work towards eventually like being able to pay cash or mostly cash for a house, which is practically unheard of these days. And so that was really just the, the focus and the priority of this channel was to be seeking first, you know, the things in life like family and uh, adventure and prioritizing those over, you know, keeping up with the Joneses. And so with that said, things have transitioned a little bit with the addition of a fifth child. Um, you know, it's, it sounds kind of crazy, but we were, we were looking at moving in here with six of us and uh, we kind of had it all planned out. We had a, a floor plan laid out. We had an idea. We chose the Airstream with that in mind of, of four kids, two adults. And whenever you throw another baby in there, it really just, it kind of went beyond the max of this space. Um, additionally, when we found out, we started to kind of, you know, look around and question, okay, like, you know, is this still gonna be feasible? So we, we, we talked to some campgrounds and come to find out, pretty much all campgrounds that aren't like state parks or national parks, um, they have a maximum for most of their uh, slots and six seems to be the max for pretty much every campground. So um, just our family growing to seven kind of hindered our ability to still do what we were wanting to do. You know, I think one of the big adventures of life is just the fact that like things do change. You know, we, we go through seasons where where different things happen and you have plans and you know things just they change and they shift and and you know I know in our life so often when when one thing doesn't work out we move into doing something else or pursuing something else that really ultimately ends up being uh, just better and so much more of what you know we, we didn't really know that we even wanted or needed and so um, with that being said you know, yes, we are. We are disappointed and we're sad at the fact that you know we're we're not necessarily going to be able to live in this airstream that we have been putting so much time and effort and money into. Um, but we're excited about you know just what's what's coming and what the future holds. And you know we're excited about this new baby that we're adding to our family. And we're excited about just the new adventures of life. And so we're not really seeing this as as like a as a real negative thing, but we're seeing it as is a, is a positive and an opportunity to be like, okay, so, you know, what's next? And that's something that, you know, honestly, since we found out that we've really been processing and um, just uh, starting to mull over. And there's been some things um, that, you know, that, that we have been passionate about, some projects that we had started that didn't necessarily work out in the past and some other things, um, you know, that, that have really been a part of you know me and and our family that we're kind of that we're excited about the the stuff that's coming um, so we're not gonna get there quite yet but um, with that said we are selling the airstream <laughs> now we're not gonna be selling it in its current state because well we really couldn't get much for it maybe just some scrap metal pricing but um, <laughs> but the plan is to put the subfloor back in, put the shell back on, put the walls back in, put the windows back in, put everything back on it um, correctly and new, renovated, just as, uh, in the same way that we were gonna do it before, making it really epic 
and um, kind of once we get it to a you know rolling chassis state, um, we're gonna kind of decide if we're gonna try to sell it like that or um, finish it out and sell it like that. I'm leaning towards just getting it finished and, and selling it complete because I just feel like we're gonna be able to get more for it. It'll take a little bit longer, but you know in the end we'll get a lot more money for it ultimately. Um, you know we're definitely open to you know if somebody's like, hey I love what you guys are doing with it. I love the vision. You know I'd love to have an airstream like that, and so you know I'd love to to make a plan to to purchase it from you and finish it kind of like how they may want it. I'm, I'm totally open to that. So if you're watching this and you're interested, feel free to message us. <laughs> um, but that's the plan with the Airstream. I'm going to do another video here in a few weeks, just kind of giving an update of where we are. Um, we're going to be um, continuing to create videos about the Airstream, um, but the channel is going to be changing. We're going to be changing the name, we're going to be changing the direction some, and this is kind of part of the new door and the new thing that we're going to be doing, and I am unbelievably excited about it. And, well, here, let me just give you a little sneak peek of, of what's to come. So I hope that little sneak peek got you excited, but you're going to have to stay tuned until next week whenever we reveal the future direction of this channel and what is coming. You're not going to want to miss it, so if you haven't already, subscribe to our channel. We're going to have some amazing content coming. We're going to continue the Airstream renovation, and we got a whole lot of stuff in this new direction that we're going in. So you guys have an awesome day, and we'll see you next week.